Ever wondered about the chilling tale of Australia's most perplexing cold case, the Pajama Girl murder? On the first day of September in the year 1934, a body, burnt beyond recognition, was found on the side of a road near Albury, New South Wales. The only identifiable feature was a distinctive yellow pyjama top, leading to the unknown victim being dubbed the Pajama Girl. Picture Australia in the 1930s, a nation grappling with economic hardships and social changes post the Great Depression. Crime rates were soaring, and amidst this turmoil, the sinister discovery of the Pajama Girl added a haunting layer of mystery. The initial investigation was a maze of dead ends. With fingerprinting in its infancy and DNA analysis a thing of the future, authorities had little to go on. The only lead, her distinctive yellow pyjama top, gave no clues to her identity. Thus, the pyjama girl remained a perpetual mystery. The pyjama girl case was a labyrinth of false leads and dead ends, but it never faded into obscurity. Over the years, it danced on the edge of the public's consciousness, a captivating enigma that refused to be forgotten. The mystery of the pyjama girl became a symbol of the unknown, and her story, a haunting narrative that echoed through the decades. As we stepped into the 21st century, the winds of change brought along advancements in forensic technology. DNA analysis, once a concept of science fiction, became a tangible tool in the hands of investigators. Facial reconstruction techniques evolved, offering a new lens to view the past. These advancements breathed new life into the case, igniting a beacon of hope. Could the identity of the pyjama girl finally be revealed? Could her story finally be told? After decades of tireless effort, a breakthrough finally came, revealing the true identity of the pyjama girl. The pyjama girl was no longer an unidentified victim. She was Linda Agostini, a woman with a story, a life and a name. Linda Agostini, born in England and moved to Australia, was a figure marked by personal struggles and a turbulent marriage. Her story, a tale of dreams met with harsh reality, painted a poignant picture of her life. Linda's husband, Antonio Agostini, was a prime suspect, his confession providing the final piece of this intricate puzzle. He painted a tragic tale of a heated argument turned deadly, a panicked cover-up, and a regret that haunted him until his confession. The revelation of Linda's identity brought a sense of closure, yet it also unveiled a chilling narrative about her life and untimely demise. Her story, marked by turbulence and tragedy, echoed the societal issues of her time, laying bare the harsh realities many women faced. As we find closure in the revelation of Linda Agostini's identity, the echoes of this mystery continue to resonate, a haunting reminder of the fragility of life and the importance of seeking the truth.